I know with my young family years ago, saying grace at the table with a bunch of hungry kids was just like, oh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. And a lot of lots to be said, a lot of good to be said about thankfulness and being grateful. Because especially when you're giving thanks for food, you're asking his blessing on it, right? So it's kind of nice if you think about if the cook, if you're not grateful and thankful to the cook, you know, oh, hey, this is great. Thanks. You know, give me some more. But you're not grateful and thankful. The cook is not going to put that much effort into it, right? Rather it's your mom or anybody else. The same, I would think, right? Our attitude should be toward the Lord to give thanks for our food, but mean it. Take time and say, you know, I really appreciate the fact that I have food on my table and I appreciate that you bless this to the nourishment of my body. Truly bless it to me. And it's just that little things like that to make us remember that we don't take God for granted. He's a mighty and big God. And the blessings, things that he gives us, let's not take take them for granted. Because there's a time where we might not have the things that we have, might not have the situations that we have. So let's be thankful for what we have, for when we have it. Amen? Blessings.